Good morning, everybody. This is Steve Fletcher with the Trumpet for My People. Today is September 10th, 2021, 10 a.m. here in Yucatan, Mexico. And I want to bring you two updates this morning. The first update is from spaceweather.com. And uh, we've got a couple in interesting uh, pieces of information here. And uh, we really need to be on top of this because things are happening rapidly the sun is changing quickly over the last couple of weeks and there there's a lot of activity going on here we need to be on top of here a lopsided CME is coming okay last week three CMEs missed earth will this week be different another CME is on the way following an explosion in the in the magnetic canopy of sunspot AR 2864 on September 8th NOAA analysts believe Earth could experience a glancing blow or near miss late on September 11th. Okay, so we have an incoming CME that may hit a glancing blow or it will be a near miss. It's going to be close. We've got to keep an eye on that. Okay, if we go down here, another part of this report. Okay shows this okay this is a sunspot sunrise sunrise on September 9th was something special okay as I have shared with you and we are in the midst of the Feast of Trumpets from September 8th through tonight September 10th sunrise on September 9th was something special this is how the Sun came up over the Sierra del Cid with a sun full of spots and mountaineers surrounded by pines. Okay. Says photographer Jordi L. Coy of Spain. Right. Yes, this picture is real. Coy took it using a Canon 5D MK4 digital camera and a safe solar filter. It is only one exposure. Now listen to this, guys. It's been years since images like this were possible. The last time the sun had so many spots was September 2017 at the tail end of old solar cycle 24. New solar cycle 25 is matching and could exceed its predecessor. Stay tuned for more weird sunrises. Okay. The last time the sun had so many spots was September 2017. What happened? What happened in September of 2017? The Revelation 12 sign. Okay. The sign of the woman clothed with the sun, the moon at her feet. And this is what we're watching right now. The four year anniversary, the parable of the fig tree, the four year delay of judgment okay and so what we are watching then is the sign of Virgo which is on the Feast of Trumpets so more sunspots growing we've got all of these visible even right now this is this is today okay all of these visible sunspots that are actively growing some are even larger than than uh, even the planet Jupiter. Okay, we've talked about this in the last couple days. Now let's go to Stellarium. Okay, and I want to show you guys where we are right now. This is right now. This is uh, in Jerusalem time. Okay, got it all set here to Jerusalem time. The Feast of Trumpets is coming to a close here. We are coming to a close on the Feast of Trumpets. The moon is right here. All right. I just want to. I want you to focus on the moon here. Let me get it up here. And we're going to go forward a couple hours, and we're going to just see how many hours we have left to get it to right in this area here, the moon under her feet. Okay. Let's go forward. Okay. Let's go forward one hour, two hours, three hours, four hours, five hours six hours okay this is midnight okay going into the early morning of September 11th 
we're going to see it break that threshold beneath the feet of Virgo, entering into Libra, which represents judgment. Okay, I think this is very indicative of where we are right now as we're coming to the end of the Feast of Trumpets. Looking up tonight, over the next hours, over the next day, okay? So this is what I, I think we need to uh, continue watching. I just wanted to bring these, these pieces of information to you. Uh, we are so close. Joe Biden, last night on the Feast of Trumpets, delivered his six-pronged speech and made it very clear that this, this, this pandemic is a pandemic of the unvaccinated and their patience is drawing thin and they are going to have to move now on those who refuse to get the vaccination. Okay, so he went on and on and on and on and all the mandates are coming now, all the mandates. Okay, for those who still think this is not the mark of the beast, you're not going to buy or sell without it. People are not going to be able to work without it. Do you understand? Okay. So I pray you guys are blessed. This is Steve Fletcher with a trumpet for my people. The sign of his coming revealed.